Okay, uh, today I'm going to do a totally different procedure. Normally, I lay the mono coat on the base coat, and I start in the center, and I, you know, gradually stick the trims uh, directly. And that creates a lot of problems. It creates bubbles, and you have to put pin pricks, and then get rid of the bubbles. Uh, so, uh, all thanks to Firoz and Vivek Bali, uh, who showed me another way to do it. Uh, this is half a bottle of uh, water and about that much of colon in it and I'm going to spray it on onto the surface that I'm going to work on so that is sprayed on and I'm going to now lay the red trim over it I've already got my marks here so this is my first mark I lay it here and the, everything is in place Little bit of touch with the hand you just get in just right and that is perfect got a piece of cloth handy and i need to work on this and i will need a piece of cloth for that also so uh, so that it doesn't leave marks so i'm just going to tear off a piece of cloth from here mm -hmm. i'm just going to cut it a bit that's it and we're going to cut out here and we have this so I'm going to I'm not going to use the the credit card to directly remove the water from underneath I'm going to wrap it inside a little, a little bit of cloth so it becomes a little soft and doesn't leave marks uh, on the monocoat so here goes uh, one and two and I'm going to use this side so I'm going to gradually now get rid of the water, get it out and use this other piece to absorb all the water that's coming out. Now to get it out on the other side, now I'm doing this for the first time. I've done a practice job, it did work out perfect, but uh, in a practice job and in a real job, a lot can go wrong and can make some stupid mistake and ruin the whole uh, ironing on our coat. So let's get rid of the water from the sides and on top of it. Uh, it looks good, it seems to have stuck quite nicely to it. Just give it another run through so there's not any colon left underneath and this side little bit is coming out from somewhere or the other and you can get rid of it completely and I think that looks good okay let's get rid of this water lying around it all over okay that's done uh, looking pretty neat I wish I could just leave it like this uh, okay I have brought my iron to a much lesser temperature than I normally do on my main work so I'm going to start from the center and gradually move from the center to all directions uh, I could do a circular motion but I'm scared that I might create some other problem so I'm going to do a light heat first and from there then I will increase the heat so far so good okay I can increase the heat a bit now uh, so far looking good and I'm going to keep it for slightly longer durations to help the glue to melt so far no bubbles when I'm ironing it and it's getting a bit warm and heated up I can see slight ripples coming in but as it cools those ripples seem to vanish straight away uh, so when the ripples come I get a minor heart attack that is almost ruined but the ripples go away I think that much of heat may just be okay it's looking good still no bubbles anyway uh, just apply a little more heat to yeah see that the ripples came in and they vanished and gone 
no air bubble. So that means this heat is, was excessive a little bit. I'm going to turn it down slightly and bring down the temperature a bit. But I think we are done. She's holding pretty nicely. Uh, doesn't seem to have any issues anywhere and no bubbles. Uh, let's have a look. I'm going to lift this surface. Yeah, she's stuck all right. Now that part I'm going to do later because I'm going to apply more heat and I'm going to stick it in nicely, nice and hard so that never comes off. So not bad. Works perfect. And this is the uh, piece that uh, will come here. So I'm going to align that up, leave that much of a gap there for this to, you know, go into that part and align these parts. So I'm now I'm going to the second part and I hope this video helps other people. Effie and Vivek Bali. Bali from Gurgaon, Effie from Mumbai. Thank you so much for this procedure. Loved it.